So if you saw the last one, I said I just woke up, so I'm not really... But still, here we go. Official gameplay reveal now, though. So last time we did just the agent reveal, where they're just showing us Vice, and now we get this one, which is the official reveal for the character. So... I'm sorry, what? I'm sorry. I'm sorry, what? What? Dude. This may have been the coolest gameplay reveal that they've done yet. Like, first off, she, like, she looks sick. Alright, hold up a second. Let me take a look here real quick. Um... Vice, lure the man, da 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 da. Uh, now a new agent. So it doesn't even say here. Like, it genuinely doesn't even say here. Like, because I was looking to see maybe if it said, maybe it said, say if they're, you know, what, what, what they are. But, so I'm gonna go with she. But, do <laughs> this is not a trap, because it was activated after. This gets activated at... So, the cool thing is, is and I noticed this just barely. So, when she when she goes to put the wall, if you watch, when she does it, right? She does the, the little goop, and then when she throws it, you see the mark there. Dude, that's such a small thing to notice, unless, you're like unless your map knowledge is incredible. That's a small thing to notice. <laughs> Yeah, see, she goes through. Huh? Maybe it does... Maybe it does activate just automatically. Like, it's an auto... Like, it's a trip wall. Because if you saw the way that happened, though, they went through... Hmm. Now, did she shoot that? This part was so freaking fast. Okay, so that one goes off, which creates the... Yo, that looks sick. That looks cool. So, it's a little area, you walk over it. Okay. But now, this is the thing I wanted to see, was it... Did she shoot this herself? Huh. She doesn't even shoot it. She just l goes up. Almost like presses the button. Yeah, that's exactly what it is. Because if you look down here, the symbol is open. So the symbol has the green underneath it and it's there. And it, she goes up. And then when she comes back down, now it's, now it's grayed out and there's a 20. 
So do you have to activate that by yourself? This is gross. So her ultimate. One looks sick. So it looks like it's a big AoE. Sends out. But what it does... So I was kind of right. It, it locks you out of your main gun, but it doesn't. What it does... Is it basically destroys whatever gun you have and forces you to use your sidearm. It forces you to use your pistol. Damn. Oh, interesting. She was able to use that again. She was able to use that flash again, so I wonder if... I wonder if the flash is like a con like the rose there, the rose flash thing. I wonder if that's a constant thing that just stays there, and when the charge goes all the way down, you can use it again. Actually, that would make sense with the timer because she used it right there before this fight even starts. Right. Me. Okay, so kind of a first look at the what it looks like when she's throwing the stuff down. Like it looks like it looks a little ball. I doubt. I doubt that's what it's gonna look like on the map, though. Because if that's what that looks like, that should be easy to walk around. Also, I just realized this. That she has a rose right here, on her like, on her palm, on her wrist. Um, but then they do it again here, and when they do it here, it like well, one of these times it fades into the ground after right there. Oh, and it looks as. Okay, so it has this weird, it has this effect, so like, I think you can activate all these. I think either you can activate them, or they could just get activated. Oh, so I just realized Omen's up here just creepily just staring. How long has he been there for? Oh, he just, he just TP'd up there. But like, look at that, like, it just, it's showing, it's showing how... This is such a trippy trailer because it's like it's it's hitting the same notes over and over and over again, and it's repeating the all uh, all uh, all paths end here, and it's just tri like it's very trippy with that. Now that's interesting. That one. So every other one that we've seen so far, she's just put the rose up, and it's just gone up. This one, however, if you look at it, she puts it on the back side of the wall. She puts it on the back side of the wall, and it, and it like, goes through the wall onto the other side. So I'm wondering if there's a way that you can throw it. So, like, if I throw it at this wall here, I can throw it at the wall, and I have it work normally. Or I can throw it at the wall and have it go through to my bedroom. Right, like that sort of thing. Please don't flashbang me while I'm asleep. Um, but that's what I'm wondering right now because that's that's what that seems. Like. You get what you fight for. Interesting. You get what you fight for. Right here, you see, off rip. So she has two, it looks like it may be two traps out, right? But still, when she starts, she goes down and over, down and over, right? Right here, like, look, see, she goes down, the bunk clicks off, she goes over, the bunk clicks off. So she activates the traps. Oh, that's... Dude, that's... Yeah. 
with me. Valorant didn't need to cook this hard. I'm gonna just say, Valorant did not need to cook this hard. This is unreal. This is unreal. Wow. <laughs> Vice. Dude, I, I genuinely love the character. I love the design of the character. I like the abilities. I like the fact that they're traps. And then normal things that we see, but instead of them, like, almost auto-activating. Right, like, you throw out the trap, it activates. Right? You, like, you know, you put the thing up when they walk past it, and it happens, right? You throw the flashbang. These are all things that you just put on the map, and then you have to activate yourself. It's kind of gross. I really like that. I'm very intrigued to see how it will play in game, though. Because now that I know that's what it is, I don't think I can actually play this character because I'm not that good. Um, but I am intrigued, though. I'm very intrigued by this character. So, um, now the big thing is this, though. You guys, people who play the game a lot more than I do, what do you guys think of Vice? Is it Vice? Am I saying this right? Is it Vice? I don't know how else to say this. Vice. Let me know. All right, let me know down in the comments down below, right? Um, I'm intrigued. I'm very intrigued. I will be playing again soon-ish. Soon-ish. It all depends on when me and Rob can get on. Um, but even then, if we can't, I'm still probably going to get on and try out Vice. Because um, I genuinely want to see how it, how everything kind of seems like it, it works. Man. This is a hell of a way to wake up on a, on a Friday. Jesus. Is it Friday? I don't even know what day it is right now, dude. Um, let me know down in the comments down below, right? As always, depending on where you are, morning, afternoon, even night. So, Trump, stay safe. We go talk to y'all later. Bye. And not just the fact that this is all rose based and like thorn based. And I know I've said this before with other agents, right? Like, oh, I'm so excited to play this agent. Not this one. I'm actually excited to play from play. This is an agent that I can get behind. I love. Dude, I, I, I freaking love roses.